In this episode, we'll finish up our Angular 7 application by applying some styling in it. In the final application, we have a crow in the navbar brand. To get it, we'll use a library called Font Awesome. To set up Font Awesome in the project, we'll use a CDN. Copy the provided link. Open up the index.html file, and paste the link just below the favicon link. Now let's get the crow icon. Copy the HTML tag. Open up the navbar component file, and paste the tag just before the bird galaxy text. Great, we now have our bird icon. The next thing that we are going to do, is to find a nice looking font family for our app. To do so, we'll use the Google Fonts library. There are a huge amount of fonts available. Hopefully, I already know which one I'm looking for. In this window, we'll customize the font based on our needs. Here we'll use a 400 font weight for the text, 500 italic for the headers, and also 700 italic for the navbar brand. This time, we'll use the import tag to import the library. Open up the style CSS file, and paste the tag at the top of it. Let's style the navbar brand. Here, we'll apply a 700 font weight with italic font style. Before continuing, we have to actually declare the font family globally in our application. In that way, all the components will benefit from it. To do so, we'll use the app root selector. Alright, all the components declared in the app component are displayed with Nurimit. Now let's fix the header's font weight and style. To complete this app, the last thing we have to do is to justify the divisions. 
To do so, we'll use the text justify class from Bootstrap. As you can see, this is much better. Congratulations! We finally made it! In the next and last episode we'll see how to deploy our application to the web. See you soon!